again super quick let's see from here the animal lover yeah they have seven pets you come together seven but i'm going to go super quick yeah because i teach you in detail already is dog is five biscuit is cat is four biscuit how many of them come together? How many biscuits? Biscuit that they eat together is 32. 32. They want you to find the number of dogs and number of cats. Let's see from here. I'm going to set up equation from you. Number of dogs. We don't know. We don't know the number of dogs. We give it x. Number of cat we don't know as well, but we know that it's come together seven pet. So that means number of cat has to be seven minus x. Now what we do next? We know that is dog. Is dog has five biscuit. Is cat has four biscuit. Yeah, a number of biscuit. This one is my biscuit. Number of biscuit come together thirty two. So I'm going to set up equation super quick from here. Um, again, don't forget that we would like to find number of dogs and number of cats. The technique is you write down with me everything that pop up there. One of the technique is you need to read the question twice. Okay, let's do it together. Number of dogs. Okay. Number of dogs plus number of cats equals seven. Yeah, so it's like a seven plus number of cats seven minus x equals seven. If you not believe me, you solve it. Yes, it's this. Now I'm going to set up the number of biscuits that the dogs and the cats have come together the question tell us is is 32 so the number of biscuits that the dog have is 5 times x yeah because we have x dogs is dogs is dog has 5 biscuits how about cat is dog has 4 biscuits so it's 4 times 7 minus x yeah and this is it now you get our um, equation okay so good now i would like to go super quick i will let you solve this equation with you okay but let me do this i need more space so i'm going to delete this one quick one to here look good now need more that space as well now you have to know something here when we solve equation we have to method we have the method that i tell you is is um elimination method and move to another side i'm going to show both for you let's see let me do the question first one first but i'm going to fit everything in here okay let's do method one method one we call move to another side oh sorry method one we call elimination yeah. and method two we call move to another side of their equation. Of the equation. Okay. I'm going to do both, but we're going to do in the next page. Let's go together. 5x plus 4 times 7 minus x equals 32. 
Okay, guys, we're going to start with the method one. Method one. Elimination. Elimination. Okay, what we have from here? Method one, elimination. You remember our equation, yeah? Five times x Five times x plus four times plus four times seven minus x equals thirty two. Let's do them together, huh? Quick one. Okay, 5 times x is 5x. I write down 5x here. And then we have 4 times 7 is plus 20x. 4 times negative x is minus 4x. Yes, and it's equal 32. Same, 32 here. I pick up this one. 5x minus 4x is equal x. Write down x here. So we have plus 20x here, plus 20x is equal 32, right now 32 here, yeah. same, 32, all right, going to the next one, we would like to do elimination method, so now we have x plus 28, Again, don't forget that I want you write out with me, yes? You write out with me together. You could write on your iPad or your notebook as well. Yeah. Don't just watch, just try to write together so you can practice them. Equal 32. Okay. By the way, when you try to solve equation, I tell you something. Oh, someone asked me, how come can you teach two hour, two hour and smile all the time? Well, maybe because I'm happy to do that. If I'm not happy, I don't smile. Okay. 28 minus 28 equals zero because you want to get rid of 28. You need to subtract both sides of the equation. So it's going to be x. So the x minus 28 gone. Actually, it's not really gone. It's kind of like a turn to be zero. But I don't want to write out here. I assume that you know it's equal zero. Now we have 32 minus 20x equal four. Oh my goodness. What does this mean? So that means you know the number of dogs already, yeah? Again, our dogs, number of dogs equal x. Number of cat equal seven minus x. You know number of dog already. Now you want to find our number of cat. Okay. Now we have our dogs with is equal x, so number of dog equal four. We want to find number of cat with is equal seven minus x, so it's equal seven minus four, which is equal three. So now you have your answer. You want to come back to our question again. Here. What they want you to find out? They want you to find out is in here, guys. How many dogs and how many cats are there? Okay. So what do we have here? We have four dogs and three cat and they said this one is your answer but we're not finished yet we're going to do the method number two move to another side of equation with i support is quicker let's go together save this one first go to the next one okay guy method two Okay, we have the same 
equation, yeah, we have 5x plus 4 times 7 minus x equals 32. Okay, let's do that. This method is method 2, which I'm quite like it. I think it's quicker. Method 2, we call it move to another side of the equation. Of the equation. They write out together from here. Thank you, my graphic board and technology. Otherwise, you will not see me. Now you can learn with me. We can learn together everywhere. 5x is 5x here. Plus, look at this one carefully, everyone. 4 times plus 7. 4 times 7 is 28. Down here, 28. Next one, 4 times negative x. Don't forget that you have negative x, not just a. 4 times negative x is negative 4x. And again, it's equal 32. Match them, huh? 5x minus 4x, we have just x left. Write out x here. x. And then you still have plus 28 equals 32. Oops, 32. Now I'm going to do move to another side of equation. Do you remember our concept? Yes, you remember our concept. Plus turn to be minus. Minus turn to be plus. Color like positive turn to be negative. Negative turn to be positive. Multiply turn to be divided. Divided turn to be multiply. I teach you about the symbol in detail later on or you could come back to see our equation yeah all right now let's go move to another side of equation i want to move positive 28 to another another side of the equation i know that x equal 32 28 plus 28 tend to be minus 28 so it means my x or number of dog equal 4. Yes, that's it. Again, you want to find the number of dogs with its equal x. We found it already. And number of cats, which is equal 7 minus x. Yes. So. Let's find out how dog we find it here. Good. How about the cat? Number of cat equals 7 minus x. You substitute x here equal 4. 7 minus 4 equal 3. So that's it. So you find the answer. 4 dogs and three cats and this one is your answer yes <laughs> finally you find out the answer okay guys i think i would like um let me tell you something which one that you prefer between the first method or the second method elimination or move to another side for me, I prefer move to another side of the equation because it's quicker. 